It's your girls. I'm May. And I'm Jay. And of course, we are here to talk about any and everything because we're the knowers. All right, so you like our hair? We're, we're like doing it. like this summertime. All you gotta do is we're say group. yes. Don't deny what you feel. Let me in my range. Oh, no. First, you went in it low. I, do. I go low. I go high. When I go low, your voice already kind of sounds like a man. You should go lower. She is something else. Yes, like, she get to these topics. All right, let's, let's get right into it. Let's talk about these biopics. It is like it's, biopic season. Right. We just got to keep talking about it because they keep making updates right, and people are getting mad. So we've talked about the Whitney Houston biopic before. Mm -hmm. And here's the thing. I didn't know this. It is directed by Angela Bassett. Yo, Angela Bassett, Lifetime. That's Lifetime. what you do. It's her directing debut. Oh. Which I get it. Who wouldn't want a Whitney Houston story? Who doesn't movie? want to get it? But come on. You're in that range. There needs to be some kind of respect. And the here. family is not happy. Let's start with talking about Bobby Christina. Oh, she going off. Honey. Off on her Twitter. And you know, she probably Christina comes from that And you know she on drugs. So and she said I'm type of crazy. And she's from that generation who could care less about yeah, respect and she, all that She's kind of like stuff. resurrecting how Whitney in her comments. She, well, she's Bobby and Whitney's daughter. Yeah. But anyway, I don't know um, so we have, of course, Yaya from America's Next Top Model is playing with me. And she mm -hmm. says she has basically cut herself off of social media just so she can just get rid of the naysayers and just right. focus on the craft. But here's something we found to be very interesting. They are not using Whitney Houston's voice. Deborah Cox is singing on there. Now, of course, we know Deborah Cox has the a great voice. You get it. Great right, voice, right? right? Great voice, but it don't sound like Whitney. She's not Whitney, and she doesn't sound like Whitney. She doesn't sound like Whitney. She doesn't, doesn't try to sound like Whitney. That's the difference. Not trying to sound like Whitney, and it's just people are just getting really pissed. I'm am disappointed that. in Angela Bassett because the thing is, when you don't have clearance and blessings from the family as a black as a black woman, I feel like as, you and a woman that. who who has played in a movie with Whitney Houston, you should really respect. And that. his and Sissy is not happy, and she's basically saying there's no one. That's connected to this movie that was connected to Whitney. Wow. Bobby Christina just mad because they didn't cast her. And again, right. And again, it's on Lifetime. It's on Lifetime. Boo. Boo. Depressing. I hate Lifetime. I don't yeah. want to see it come across I my people channels. who watch Lifetime all day. It's because they're it's depressed. Like, it makes me sleep. I said it. I think I just crossed my eye. <laughs> Oh, <laughs> all right. So let's get into these freaky relationships, right? So oh let me give you guys who was seen on a date at the ESPY Awards. None other than Hi, Lil Wayne and Christina Million and Christine, Nick White, Nick 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 Cannon's ex girlfriend. Well, that it gets even deeper than being Nick Cannon's ex. Who wants to be referred to as Nick Cannon? Anywho. It gets even deeper. Right, okay, so let's let's talk about it. Let's go through this. Lil Wayne, Lil Wayne, who has several baby moms. Several baby moms. But we're only going to focus on one. One. Had a baby and was engaged to Nivea. Don't mess with my man. Yeah, kind of like one hit wonder. But in, right. follow along with this. So Lil Wayne, mm -hmm. all right, ex-fiance, baby mama, Nivea. Nivea. Then we take his date, Christina Milian. Christina Milian. Current girlfriend. Current Person he's dating, right? Ex-wife of the dream, dream. Who? who was also the ex-husband of Nivia, of Nivia, who has a baby by Nivia and Lil Wayne. Nivia has a baby by Lil Wayne, and Christina Milian has a baby by Dream. So they got their children are like super siblings, super siblings. If they get and if them. and if Christina Milian. Has a baby by Lil Wayne. And it's like super, super siblings. They should all just live in a mansion together. They should all live in a mansion together. But what does that say about Nivea and Christina and Emilio? Oh, what does it say about Lil Wayne and the dream? And the dream. So, so either Mil the dreaming Lil Wayne are the same person. Yep. Or Christina Million and maybe are the same person. It's all kind of yucky. It's weird. It's and Christina Million just recently broke up with her fiance. Um, I believe his name is Jay Prince. Yes, Jay Prince. And Lil Wayne wrote a song that kind of dissed him and basically said she don't need no prince. She need a king. A what? Womp, womp, a what? Womp. What are your kid? What do you rule? The most interesting part about this, Nicki Minaj. Who do you roll, Lil Wayne? Nikki? <laughs> I, 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 I
this chick is crazy. <laughs> Whatever her stuff doesn't go out. It, if I don't get what she's talking about, she just go for the laugh. Go ahead, do it again. Do it again. <laughs> My MacBook. You're crazy. That's girl. Anywho. Alright, so let's talk. We back on the biopics, alright? Yep. So we got the Leah biopic. Uh-huh. Zendaya dropped. Out. Zen dropped. Yeah, she basically Zen said, dropped. Zen dropped. I know it was a bad She man. claims it was conflict with her schedule. Mm. Mm. I think it was conflict with the whole. Yeah, I she, think she didn't want deal. that backlash. Get out. Let me get it out. It was a great deal. I think it was a great choice to move out. Thank you. Good job. But now we have this chick called it named Alexandria Ship, 23 year old chick um, who they've cast to play Aaliyah. And Wendy Williams has picked up as the producer of this uh, biopic. <sighs> How you doing? How you doing? But well, listen, tell me how you doing. Why yeah. are you able to be a lifetime? <laughs> how are you able to be a lifetime? Yeah, I was like, yes. so be able to watch lifetime. How you doing? How you doing? Uh, yeah. All right. So speaking of Wendy Williams, Wendy Williams got a gender bender fight. Gender bender fight. Wow. Wendy Williams is into it with a bigger queen king. I call him a queen king. Queen king because queens, Jack queens, what you call men who are want to be women, but they are women who kind of act. Like drag queens, so I'm called queen kings. It's all disrespect for true queens. Yeah, hello. How you doing? Hello. All right, so Wendy Williams and Nene Leakes are into it. Nene Leakes went off on Wendy Williams on her blog, calling Wendy Williams mean. Isn't that the pot calling the kettle? And the kettle calling the, the pot. pot. You understand? But anywho, all of it makes no sense. They're just mad because they're both tall and big. And... <laughs> what are you doing? What are you going? Have, have a seat. We got some good stuff to talk about. I don't want you to go. Go have a seat. I don't want you to. I need to finish talking about. I want to keep. I want to get to this Floyd and Tiny and Ti stuff. All right. So Floyd Mayweather just won't let Tiny and Ti there are working on a relationship. Floyd, listen to me. You might be able to beat Ti in the streets with these. Uh huh. But Ti got. <laughs> Conference that's uh, he's supposed to be doing this fight uh, with uh, Marcos, whoever, whatever he got. Just go ahead. No, not Marcos Palacios. But anywho, oh, he's supposed to be doing it. Hello, too. Okay, anywho, so he's supposed to be doing this uh, fight, and someone then yells out, What about T.I.? He's basically like, T.I.'s up, and I'm his. Whoa! Whoa! First of all, Floyd, stop trying to say sensation, sensationalism for your up and coming fight that nobody care about. But here's the thing. It ain't He's mad out. because Tiny dissed him at the BET Awards. He tried to grab her. She's trying to keep her man. And you know she's trying to keep her man? She got a new single out. Hey. So what you going to do? Uh, if I listen uh, to a nice little song. It is. It is. Style nice. Tiny's looking good. As good as, Tiny can, as good as Tiny time. can look. Kind of gives me that total escape feel. Yes. Really. I love it. I'm, shout out to Tiny and then. But T.I. made a song. To her, called "Stay," Honey. and the lyrics on there, he said, yes. "He said, what you gonna do? Answer me, answer it's me. Like, it's it's not rhetorical. Yes, I love every minute of Ti. I love you. I, yes. I am rooting for Ti and Tiny. Real quick, Nay Rivera, Big Sean's ex girl is already married. married. Her Big Sean just broke up, and this chick just got married in Mexico this weekend. What? Yes. What? How long would that last? You better watch out, Glee. Speaking of how long will something last? What's that? Rumor has, and I can't wait because I'm going to the On the Run Tour tomorrow. Beyond Without me. Jay, Without me. It's clear that there is trouble in Carter land. So, <laughs> I guess y'all have to get my report after I go to that On the Run Tour. I'll let you all know, but from what I heard, the chemistry Uh-oh. is proving <laughs> that... Yes, Yonce ain't feeling Jay Z. That was a rap. Mm. Yonce, I, you know, I don't like it. Right. I don't like it. All right, now for an advertisement. The Black Mall's new office is on 11006 South Michigan. In Chicago, Illinois. In Chicago, Illinois, on Michigan Avenue South. You need to come out. We also are selling products like this beautiful nail polish mm. here. Mm. Dion Francis. I have all these great summer colors. So what makes the polish so great? The polish is great because it's non-toxic. Non-toxic. It's so. non-toxic and it lasts. And I put on one coat. I don't know if you can see them a little toasty. No, don't. Save people. <laughs> <laughs> 
<laughs> don't do it. If you want them to still like you, don't do it. All right. Well, baby, you a mess, honey. They gonna love me anyway, baby. Oh, that's right. Hello. Ooh. Hello. Flip it. Do it again. Oh, one more time. Go back. Hello. Oh, oh. Uh -oh. you okay? okay? I'm good. You all right? Okay. All right. Um, make sure that you are following Man Case on Instagram, Twitter, and Facebook. That's M A E A N D C A S E. Yes. And that you are subscribing below subscribe, to our YouTube subscribe, channel. Subscribe, Please subscribe. Subscribe, subscribe. So, once again, it's been your girls. Mm -hmm. I'm Meg. And I'm Jay. And we will catch you same place, same, same time. time next week. Peace. There it Peace. is. Peace. We're human. We have errors. It happens. It happens. Good night. Peace.